time to decorate the kitchen. Let's add a few eye-catching design pieces to help you enjoy your household routine. We'll begin with the vase decoration. Let's turn blank jars into stunning decor items. We'll need transparent vases of different shape, acrylic sprays, and masking tape. Cover the top part with the tape to leave it blank while painting. Turn the vase upside down. Spray the bottom white. When dry, apply a pink coat in the same way. Let it dry again. Then remove the tape. Smooth the color border with a nail polish remover that contains acetone. Here it is! Just a few minutes and the plain vases have been turned into true home design pieces. Now, let's make a pretty framed memo board. Take a blank wooden frame, scrapbook paper, acrylic paints, cardstock, and multi-purpose glue. Paint the frame white. When dry, choose cool colors and make watery strokes in one direction. Then use warm colors with a little water. Mix white paint with the water and splatter the paint. Measure the frame size. Cut out the background. Done! Now make a frame stand. Draw it on thick cardboard. Use a craft knife to cut it out on a wooden board. Mark off two strips on the edges. Score up a line. Cut off the excess. Attach the stand. Use dry erase markers to write on this memo board. They can be easily erased with a paper towel. Now you'll be able to quickly write something down or leave a reminder for your family members. Next in our list, there is an amazing support under hot with soft, vivid pom-poms. We'll need yarn of your favorite colors. Take a basket and close pins. Fasten the yarn and wrap it around the pins. Tie up the yarns in several places and take out the pins. Tie again on the sides. Cut out between the knots. Trim the pom-poms and fan a bit.
You can quickly make a lot of pom-poms in this way. Take thick cardstock for the support. Choose an appropriate size. Cut out a bigger felt circle. Hot glue the felt to the cardstock. Now it's time for the pom-poms. Attach them to the cardboard. Wow, it's so fluffy. This cute colorful support under hot will help create a cozy atmosphere in your kitchen. We'll show you how to make a pretty pattern tea set quickly and easily. Put a few drops of special acrylic paint for ceramics to a bisque mug. Then blow out the paint using a drinking straw. The paint will create an intricate pattern dripping down the mug. You can either paint the entire mug or part of it. Let's decorate the teapot. Paint the lid knob, letting the colors mix freely. Cover the top of the pot with much paint to let it drip down, creating a unique ornament. Mix the colors. This paint should be dried in the oven, so follow the instructions on the paint container as for the appropriate time and temperature. The fabulous tea set design will emphasize your own individual style. Let's make a funny fox coffee cup sleeve to keep your coffee hot for longer. Make a template. To make it easy and convenient, repeat the template on thick paper. Be careful to measure out the right size. The sleeve should overlap a mug. Trace the template on the red felt and cut out. Prepare gray felt details. Glue the brown felt to the underside. Attach the button clasp. Sew it down. Now glue the elements. Sew 
Sew down the second half of the button to the tail. Decorate the fox with a neat running stitch. Attach eyes, add whiskers, and imitate fur. We've got an amusing lovely fox coffee cup koozie to cheer you up in the morning and in the daytime. These awesome kitchen design ideas will help you both decorate the room and keep it organized. Hit the like button if you like the ideas. Be sure to subscribe to the Trim Trim channel to create home design pieces for a cozy atmosphere.